Welcome to WHHI TV News. It is so exciting to have the May River High School girls golf team who are four time state champions of the South Carolina High School League for 4A. That's quite an accomplishment, Coach Campbell. I can't wait to hear all about it. It's been great to see you all play over the last couple of years, but this is your second season. Mm -hmm. Took over for Coach Manassi, who led the team earlier. And how exciting. Give us some takeaways from your season and your last two years. Well, I keep I keep telling everybody that this group is a pretty special group. And this year their record was 129 and seven. Um, and they were even better in tournaments. And so we went to a tournament heavy schedule. They deserved um, to play uh, a pretty competitive schedule and they succeeded in that. And they are, and I keep saying they're the most talented team to ever play in the county. Um, and they've proved it this year. They won their second straight state championship and it was led with, you know, a pretty unique group uh, as you'll see here soon. We're going to talk to some of the ladies. We're going to start with one of the seniors, Addison. Uh, you actually we're newer to golf, haven't played that long. Talk about what got you involved and how you feel about winning a state championship. Um, it was really exciting. Um, I really got into it through my dad and my grandfather who recently passed. Um, and he actually lended me one of his push carts. So it was like, it was really nice to have him there with me pretty much every step of the way, so. Yeah, some special memories there too. Yes, yeah, ma'am. That's awesome. Mm -hmm. uh, well, let's see. Uh, we've also got some underclassmen who have been pretty important on the team. We've got Ava and Haley, unsung heroes, as your coach called you. Uh, you had some good, solid scores, and both of you were ranked in the state top 10. That's pretty amazing. We'll let you share some thoughts first. Yeah, um, so I feel like being on the team overall has been like really nice. It's helped me like learn a lot of teamwork skills and how to like like become like closer to like my teammates and it's really like helped me like enjoy the game of golf. Like Haley was saying, us being close, I feel like this year one of my goals was to just really spend the most time with the seniors since they're leaving and to learn from them and become a leader so that we can do what they did for us. Yeah, and you've got two more years to follow up, so that's wonderful. And then in the back, we have Ella Claire. You were actually just still in middle school. You're not even in high school yet. You've been uh, two years now, seventh, eighth grade, got to win state championships. Tell us about what that must feel like being the youngest on the team and being so successful with the group. It feels really nice, especially just being able to have these seniors behind, like in front of me. Like they've been a mentor, always been able to guide me through this game. It's a very challenging game and not only the mind, but also mm -hmm. in all aspects throughout it. So they've always just been there to kind of help me throughout. She brought up a good point, Coach. Uh, a lot of mental preparation and goes into the game of golf. As a coach, talk about some of the things that you've seen, how they've prepared to maybe overcome some of those challenging times on the course. Well, they played uh, 333 holes of golf this year. So that number alone shows you there's going to be some good times in the game, but there's also going to be some yeah. rough times you got to get over. Yeah. And one of the things that I thought was really that set them apart from other teams this year was their ability to get themselves out of ruts, right? You're not going to have the perfect round. And if you do, then congratulations, but that doesn't <laughs> happen very often. Yeah. And so it was, for me, it's a point of pride because every one of them was able to set personal records and do things this year that they've never done before. And so for me, it's just very rewarding to have a front row seat to something that excellent. Yeah, that is, that's pretty cool. Well, in the back, we've got our two seniors who have been the captains. You two are going on to college. Uh, we've got Claire, Claire Green, we've got Robin. And so we're gonna actually spend a little time with you two and talk about what's next as you pursue your college um, sport uh, at a different level. So stay right here. We're gonna be back with more WHHI TV news.